What's up, you guys? If you guys don't know already, my Instagram account has been hacked, as you guys can see right here. Uh, these are all the screenshots that I was able to uh, get, and um, I uh, was able to uh, post it up on my personal Instagram page, and I shared it on my Facebook about uh, the person that had hacked me. Uh, what they did was they hacked me through another person's account, and that poor person's account was probably hacked, and they're also trying to get it back, too. Um, but what I found sketchy was that person has two other Instagram accounts, so, um, yeah, <laughs> I'm pretty sure someone is just uh, pretending to be him. Um, <clears throat> yeah, it sucks. It really sucks to be hacked. Uh, I, you know, I, I don't have that much followers on my Instagram page. I could really give less of a shit about the amount of followers that I have, but what I do give a fuck about is my, my work that I have on there. Um, and excuse my language, I give a fuck about my work on there. Um, until, you know, some low-life piece of shit try to, uh, you know, get, get your attention and, uh, manipulate you and trick you. Um, you know, that's how I lost my Instagram page. Um, I mean, I haven't lost it entirely. Um, it looks like my device uh, still does recognize my account. Only thing is, uh, this piece of shit changed my, changed the, uh, the phone number and also changed my, um, changed my email that was linked to the, uh, Instagram account or set up on the Instagram account. So with that being said, um, I am in the process of getting it back. Uh, it's just a very slow process. Uh, had I not changed my phone number, I would have gotten it back, but, uh, I changed it because I was concerned uh, and I couldn't get any sleep. Uh, I had been hacked ever since Friday night or Thursday night. And, um, I've just been in the process of trying to get it back and I'm almost there, but you know, like I said, I changed my phone number so I couldn't get, um, I couldn't get access to it again right away. So now Instagram is going to be calling that old phone number and not my new number. Um, and if they can't get a hold of me, then they're going to send me an email. That's, that's what I know. So uh, I'm just going to be checking my emails every day. Um, yeah, I, I'm glad though. The, the email account that I have. Uh, it's not linked to my YouTube channel here, as you guys see me on. So, that's a good thing. Um, it's also not linked to my Facebook. Uh, only my personal account is linked to my Facebook. So, when you guys, uh, if you guys have or haven't already, uh, continue reporting the page. Please report the page for me. Uh, that person on there is not me. So, this video here is just to show you guys who I am, really. And um, hopefully, Instagram gets their ass together and does something about this right away. Uh, from what I know, too, it's a really big issue for all of us on Instagram. Uh, hackers, they really enjoy hacking. Um, <clears throat> I don't know what they get out of it. I mean, pretty sure there's some sort of money involved. But just think about how how long that will only last. So uh, my message to hackers or anyone out there that's continuing to make dumb choices right now um, and affecting their lives, you know. I mean, we all make dumb choices, but... Some of us, we don't, um, I, I will talk about me, for example, I make dumb choices, but I learn from them, um, to better myself every day, not just for me, but for all of my loved ones, uh, especially my wife. So if you have a chance to change now, change yourself, okay, for your own good and your, change yourself for your own good and, um, your own benefit because, um, I work with people where they make a lot of they made a lot of dumb choices <clears throat> when they were young my age or even younger I'm 26 right now so um, and now those choices that they made you know such as getting like criminal records um, and just having a, a really bad background you know in the future when you're old it's going to be challenging finding home for you uh, especially if you're very low income um, and you're gonna have to sign up for like something like section 8 you're gonna be on the wait list minimum two years longest 10 years so um, these are things that you should take in with a big grain of salt a big grain of salt okay um, I think I've done enough talking here thank you for watching and please report the page. Uh, follow me on my personal Instagram page, okay? As you guys see right here.
Have a good one, everybody. Take care.